is up guys i'm excited check it out i got me a haircut mm, trimmed up the beard oh man it's hot as fuck out here god literally i don't think the air conditioner works when it's this hot and check it out i got me a toolbox back there i built some stands from some umbrellas a lot of people get them welding umbrellas but you know what i get beach umbrellas because they're like 24 dollars versus 150 <laughs> I get like 10 of them motherfuckers. Check it out, guys. I'm out handing out some cards today. Gillahan's Mobile Welding. Give me a shout. shout. <laughs> uh, I'm starting another page <laughs> or channel, whatever this is. Uh, Gillahan's Mobile Welding. It's up. I just don't have any content on there. So, guys, go, go follow that shit. Go follow it. Yeah, I'm going out prospecting, guys. It's the only way to get business, honestly. It's the only way to do it. People look at you and they see, oh, man, this motherfucker looks like he's going to work. Uh, I guess this guy's gonna cross the road on a on a don't don't cross. Mm, serious? <laughs> hey, anyway, go follow my shit and uh, yeah, get out there and do some shit, boys. <laughs> That's what's up, guys. I dropped off my first card at a damn uh, lawn place, big lawn place. They do they got like dozers and all kinds of shit. They do a lot of uh, lawns. <laughs> they do other stuff too. <laughs> But you know, it's a uh, it's a big one, so I know they got trailers and shit that need to be welded. <laughs> Cause that's what I do now. Yeah. Anyway, on to it. Whew. Guys. Oh, that's on Maxac. <laughs> that's what I call it. Dropped off another one at the uh, UPS. Hey, you gotta think big, right? Screw it, man. They, they might need a welder come out. Them trucks down. Them bumper breaks off or some shit. <laughs> You know, you never know. You never know who might need it. So, and everyone, card. Oh, I just dropped it off another card at a place called Big Johnson. Concrete placement. <laughs> when I saw the Big Johnson, I couldn't pass it up. <laughs> you know me, guys. Woo! All right, another one down, guys. Just back to back here. This place, uh, Looks like they do a lot of rock and mulch and wood and you know they have heavy but not too heavy equipment. They got you know some some dozers, some small cranes. Look here, when I when I pull out of here, see this little thing right there? I could I could weld that all day long. Looks like a little mower. Come on now. So there we go. That's what four four down so far on the same road, guys. This is you know you started one into town. By the time you get done with that, go to another town or start over. <laughs> you know, there's probably some new businesses by the time you get to the other end of town. You're never gonna make it to the end of town without getting some business, I'll tell you that much. What is this place? Fabrication, installation, maintenance. They probably do their own, <laughs> do their own welding since it says fabrication. You know what I'm saying? What is this place? Florida breeze, air and heat. Hmm. They might need. They might need one. Fuck it. You know? You never know. What does this place do? I don't know what they do, but well, I'm going to give them a card anyway. Get dudes looking at me weird. Here we go. Right. It's five cards down. I don't know what they do here, but you can see they have some big trucks and such. That's the thing, man. Guys, people will respect you when they see that you're willing to work hard enough to come out and, and get, get business damn air and heat place i don't know if they need a welder but you know what if they do it's gonna be me <laughs> wow all right just dropped off one at this air place the dude at the desk said yeah we have a bunch of trailers <laughs> guys i got a feeling i'm gonna be getting some calls soon right look there goes the trailer right there looks like it needs work <laughs> i'm your man yeah, they gotta take a break. Jeez, get some water here. Uh, just handed out another one. I've lost count. Six, six, seven. Don't know. But uh, I don't know what they do here. But they said that they had to have have somebody once. They put it on. They'll put me on file because they had to have somebody come fix their fence. Now they got some safety railing here that looks like it's about to go to shit. And uh, oh, she'll have their ass. So. They may be giving me a call soon, especially if I hit it. <laughs> especially if I run that shit over, you know what I mean? Uh, telecom, Cast Crete. 
You know they got some trailers over here at this concrete place. Cast Creek. Yeah, buddy. I'm about to get my card at the Cast Creek place. This is like eight, maybe. <laughs> I've literally lost count, guys. I'm gonna I'm gonna hand out at least fucking a bunch. <laughs> at least a bunch of cards today. Anyway, getting out here at the Cast Creek place. All right, so Cast Creek, man. I had to go around to the back, right? And uh, he he was on his his uh, forklift thing, and he's like, "Yeah, I'll be right with you." Like, oh god, who's this guy? And then I was like, oh, "I just want to give you a card." Oh, <laughs> he's like, "Oh, cool," you know. And then he's like, "Oh, you license in your shirt?" Now that just means you have a business license and insurance. That's it. That's all you gotta have. Done. <laughs> well, this place, I see trailers, man. I start to salivate. Evergreen Lawn Care. Looks like a uh, promising. I'm gonna give him a card real quick. That was not the owner. <laughs> that card might get thrown in the trash. <laughs> you win some, you lose some. But hey, they got a lot of they got a lot of trailers. That's the important thing. Where's this other place? One stop air conditioning. Where you at? Where you at one stop? Cooling and heating. Let's see if one stop needs a God dang, they got three doors. I bet they're doing some business. Do not enter. Do not enter. Is that the one I enter in down there? Jeez. Hey, which one of these doors can I enter? <laughs> Alright, well, we'll see. This may be a no-go. Hmm. It says building open, business locked. For all deliveries, call this number. So that tells me that the owner's having to work too. Uh, but, you know, they have little mailboxes hanging up. I put it on a little clip they have on the mailbox right there on the outside of the box. Now, if you're gonna do handout cards, I don't recommend that you ever put anything in the mailbox because I tried that one time with a lawn business and uh, I got called by the damn post office. <laughs> it's a small town, so they called me. Hey, you can't be doing this shit. Okay, sorry. <laughs> that was after I'd already hit hundreds of mailboxes. And I told them, I was like, man, I hit a bunch, so I'll stop now. But if you see any more, it's just ones that I'd already hit. And they were cool with that. All right, so it didn't look like anything else up in there. We're going to go on downtown. Turn around. What you gonna do right now? <laughs> oh yeah, that was a circle. I'm cool. I'm out where I where I was before. <laughs> All right, so we want to go down to US One. US One's a good road for industrial stuff of sorts. Personal mini storage. I wonder if they need anything. Hmm. Yeah, you never know. You know what I mean? Storage place. They got people storing shit. Yeah, I'll be right back. So. I have lost count. <laughs> I don't remember. This might be number 10 or 11. Damn, turn signal still on. That guy was nice. Seems like a new place anyway. It's Everything seems really new and, and nice and clean and polished. The air conditioner felt really good. My rec I'm not, I got another recommendation if you're going to hand out cards. You know, don't, don't be afraid. Don't act like you're afraid. Be jovial. Be jovial. Be bigger than yourself. You know what I mean? I mean, I'm pretty big. Ha, ha, ha. But uh, I can be bigger. <laughs> oh, it's like the faster I go, the worse my air conditioner works. Thanks, Ford. <laughs> now I like this old truck. The reason why I keep old trucks is because they're easier for me to work on, right? I can't work on the new shit. Too many electronics. You got to hook up diagnostics and shit. And uh, I mean, one time I uh, was me and my wife were doing landscaping down in uh, Deland, Florida, or uh, up in Deland. And um, we were riding along, and all of a sudden, smelled, you know, saw some smoke. What the hell? And uh, my alternator just the inner <laughs> innards melted. Not <laughs> just it was fire, fire and plastic and shit. You know, I don't know. So we pull up behind this gas station. I had to walk like what seemed like forever, but it's a couple miles to a uh, auto parts store and get a uh, alternator. Right. I don't know if you ever changed the alternator before, but it really takes a guy and a guy. Because my wife was trying to help. 
but you need somebody to pull that motherfucking tension up against that belt, and then there's a bolt that goes in, right? And, uh, you know, she probably could have done it. But anyway, there was a guy that showed up. And he was like, hey, what do you, you need some help? And he was, you know, a bicycle rider. <laughs> DUI or something, you know, uh, drunk. But I needed help. So I was like, hell yeah. So he helped me put that in. He's like, you got a couple bucks? I was like, dude, <laughs> you kidding? For a beer, right? And I gave him like 10 bucks or some shit. And he's like, I only need one beer. I was like, dude, you're going to need one tomorrow, the next day, later maybe? Come on now. Take my money <laughs> and shut the fuck up. Oh, anyway, I'm looking at this pods storage, right? They got this truck that drops off this pods. It's, it's made of steel. It looks like it's rusty. <laughs> That's a job for this guy. Uh, so I'm going <laughs> to run up here and give him a card real quick. We're the turning signal. We're at the freaking light. <laughs> In the turning lane. Yeah, I'm gonna run up here and give him a card. This motherfucker don't give a shit. He don't own the place. Oh, anyway. Yeah. Alright, guys. Going in this plumbing place. We'll see what's up. Alright, guys. Went in that place. Ooh, still haven't had any water yet. Man. I think I'm gonna die if I don't. <laughs> I guess you guys want to see me do that. Oh, man. This is fun. Yeah, I'm gonna do this for a couple hours every day until somebody calls me, you know what I mean? That's what you do. Also do the uh, Instagram page and all that. What's going on here? Okay, all right, here we go, going in. Yeah, they were open to it. I like it. They got trucks, you know what I mean? If she gets stuck on the side of the road, who are they gonna call? <laughs> Not the Ghostbusters, that's for sure. Well, unless they do have ghosts in the truck, then they would call them. The old school Ghostbusters, the guy ones. Ooh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I know a guy that owns a bait shop down here too. I'm gonna hit him up because they they got people. They got a lot of freaking boat trailers and shit coming up through there. This is the park over here. Whoa, got dark under a bridge. Under the bridge downtown. This is where I drew some blue. There's a lot of bums over here. They uh, sleep, eat, and live here. <laughs> hey man, whatever. They don't chase them off. They don't really cause that much problems, you know. They just sit around doing heroin, heroin and stuff. I'm gonna pull right over here. Into the grass. Into the grass and such. <laughs> I'm gonna run in here real quick. All right. So, I went to the bait place. Ow! Rigs. Man, that damn lock gets me every time. Pitches my arm up in there. Because it's right underneath, too. On the, on the tender part of your arm, so it makes me want to scream. Every freaking time. Oh, where to now? Here's what I don't recommend. Another thing I don't recommend. Do not do business with churches. Because <laughs> they will want everything for nothing. It's free, man. They want it for free. Because, you know, they have God in this house. This is God's house, bro. You need to do this shit for free for God. <laughs> I mean... Nothing against them, but man, when I was doing lawns, they, I had a few churches that I went and did bids for, and they were like, well, this guy does it for this, and I'm like, well, you can keep him, because <laughs> I won't. <laughs> yeah, they just want it all for nothing, right? That's when you need to get somebody that goes to church there that loves God enough to come and, you know, do stuff and help. <laughs> you know what I mean? Don't you have somebody at the church that's willing to volunteer? I need to fix this. Let's keep going down this road, though. I mean, hell, all roads lead to something, right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm looking for for places with, uh, you know, industrial equipment, trailers, boat trailers, and trailers. <laughs> and lots of trailers. There's lots of trailer owners here. That's why. <laughs> that's who I want to work with. Ooh. Industrial equipment supplies and services. Hello. Mm, industrial equipment supplies and services. I don't see any supply. <laughs> what? Guy tried to sell me some hoses while I was in there. Keep on going. I think when they meant industrial equipment, they meant like they had a bunch of nail guns in there. <laughs> I don't know, man. Weird places. I don't know what the fuck this is? Some kind of thing. AKB headquarters. 
King Spa, Trilogy Salon, Yoga, Herb Corner, <laughs> Weed, <laughs> oh, All Pro Sports Trophies, Island Cabinets and Floors. Hmm. <laughs> Still going. <laughs> The Raw Dance Center. Sounds interesting. Can I get some of that raw dancing? Just, I want it raw. <laughs> Straight up. Just as raw as you can get it. Just dance and do it raw. God. <laughs> Are you gonna have clothes on? <laughs> oh, it says weddings, private parties. Okay. Hey, they got trucks, man. So, I'm gonna go in over here and hand them a card. I'm a mobile weldy. That place was called Chairs for Affairs. And they literally rent out chairs. Get this. For affairs. <laughs> they rent out chairs for like weddings and stuff. And they've got lots of trucks. So shit seems pretty lucrative. In case you guys are wondering what kind of business you need to start. I wouldn't use that name, but you can say chairs for stuff you're doing. Need a chair? Guess what? I got chairs. All these places stay open, man. A little hippie store. You know what I mean? They got all the windows covered with like tie-dyed stuff. Right? They're in there smoking weed right now. You know it. How are they? How are they running a business back here in the middle of nowhere? Okay. Headed back towards the house. Let's see if we can stop and hand out. At least a couple more on the way. You know what I mean? Running into gigabytes here, guys. <laughs> hey, it's been a good day. You know? I uh, handed out quite a bit. I don't know how many. Uh, you know, maybe 20. Maybe. You know, at least 15, I would say. I would say at least 15. That was probably number 15 right there. Residential and commercial, it says. Residential and commercial what, guys? What do you do exactly? <laughs> it just is residential and commercial. I think these places are closed. I'm not seeing any signs of life. <sighs> Alright. So, yeah. I'm almost back. I think I'm done for the day. Alright guys, so I couldn't help myself. I ended up going to the uh, Florida Institute of Technology here. We I live right down the road from it. I figured, you know, they got some maintenance guys, but they may not have anybody they can weld for shit. So, I uh, messed up by going into the president's, well, I didn't mess up, but I went in the president's office first. And they were, they were like, fancy. <laughs> and they were like, yeah, you need to go down to HR, which wasn't too far, so I just walked. But yeah, I'm headed back to the truck now. This is a nice place. I used to ride my bicycle around here. They've got a really cool uh, botanical gardens here, too. So, anyway, I'm... Uh, Back at the old truck, the old Ford, about to head home. I know I've handed out at least 20 cards today. Come on now. All right, let's, let's call it a day now, finally.